On behalf of Singapore Dance Theatre, I would like to share with you a pivotal and momentous announcement. But before that, I would like to share with you the intention and thought behind it. Singapore Dance Theatre was established in 1988, and the two co-founders had two very specific ideas in mind. Firstly, they wanted to provide international quality dance performances for Singapore and Singapore's audiences. And in tandem with that, it was very much their desire to provide Singaporean dancers, as well as other dancers, an opportunity to explore their careers professionally here in Singapore. It's very important that that be remembered because 33 years on now, where we have now more Singaporean dancers in the company than ever before in the history, and we have an identity that's so unique and so special, um, it was the two co-founders that made that whole thing possible and created this. Now we do six seasons a year with a wide variety of performances and a very impressive repertoire. But had it not been for that original idea, none of this would have been possible. Singapore Dance Theatre, when it was first established, couldn't have known its eventual ambitions. With only seven dancers in the company and a path ahead that was basically about presenting professional performances, its eventual path and its ambitions took a little bit of time to uh, reveal itself. It was very important, mostly, that the company be established as a cultural institution for Singapore. During the first few years of Singapore Dance Theatre's existence, it began to define itself through its performances. The repertoire was composed of three very specific things. World premiere pieces that were made specifically for the company, plus international works of choreography that gave us a benchmark to keep ourselves uh, at a level with other dance companies. And then, of course, the company, with the production of the 1992 Nutcracker, um, started to do full-length narrative ballets that became very, very essential into the company's existence. With these three different pillars of repertory, the company began to chart its course through its repertory, its performances, and along with its dancers. As Singapore Dance Theatre matured, it began to establish itself in the audience's minds. And then those three pillars, classical ballets, new works, international repertory, began to balance themselves in performance and give the audience an idea of what to expect as our identity. At the present moment, we have clearly defined what is the identity of Singapore Dance Theatre, both in our own minds and in the minds of our audiences. With our performances at the Esplanade Theatre that represent the classical seasons um, with our full-length classical ballets, plus Masterpiece in Motion, which is an international repertory season. Our Peter and Blue season, uh, which is children's performances. Ballet Under the Stars, our Passages Contemporary season, as well as auxiliary things like our adult dance classes, the Scholars Program, Ballet Associates course, um, One at the Ballet, which happens every month at Singapore Dance Theatre. Um, all of these things have contributed to become what is essentially the nature of Singapore Dance Theatre. In the past few years, we have premiered 37 world premieres, plus done 19 company premieres, added to our repertoire, all balanced with our established repertory. International touring has also become very much part of our identity. It's very important that our performances be seen both in Singapore and for a wider audience internationally. To give us the best representation, we have decided to rename ourselves Singapore Ballet. This will give us the greatest opportunity to define ourselves artistically and in character to our audiences and our dancers. This is not going to change our repertoire or our essential nature. All it is going to do is further define the company that has already become important within Singapore. The only reason we are able to do this is the strength of the 33 years of Singapore Dance Theatre. Every single thing that will be in the future is because of our audiences, of our repertory, of our performances, of the dancers, of every moment in time that we have spent as Singapore Dance Theatre. The development and the maturity to become Singapore Ballet is only achieved because of everything that has come before us. There is so much ahead for Singapore Ballet, and Singapore Dance Theatre is what has made this possible.